Okay. It's essentially done. All that's left is the phone mount and the water bottle. And uh, got the cute little fenders. Got the little fenders mounted on there nice. Uh, it's charging sitting here in the shade. Hundred percent. Anyway, and I have a hundred and ten on board. Whenever I want, one hundred and twenty, I guess. One hundred and twenty, technically. AC, eight hundred watts. I uh, still trying to figure out how to get into this thing to set it on a instead of metric and. So it won't be in kilometers and everything. Having a hell of a time. I don't know why. And I don't like the power assist, so I just went and took it off. Uh, uh, this, this, the sensor, anyway. Anyway. So, I'm just about ready to take it on a trip. It's first trip. And, uh, I gotta say, I, uh, I can pump up the tires to 50 pounds real good, but 50 pounds is not adequate for this setup. This setup requires 70 pounds of air pressure in the wheels, and that uh, that makes it a lot less uh, tippy. Okay, so there it is, charging in the shade. When I park it in the sun, it really does good. Okay, so the prototype three is essentially done. This is it. Always, if if it works if, as 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 build, or as uh, you know, then it I'll never have to plug it in. It'll always be fully charged and ready to go. And that's pretty awesome. You can't beat that for a bug out vehicle. No insurance, no license, no gas, no plug ins, total freedom. Solo is the state of the art technology in personal transportation. Beats a golf cart in several ways. Now, now that's not to say that a, a golf cart's not better in most ways, but you can't take a go golf cart out and just go anywhere like you can a tricycle. So there's that. And uh, this, the tricycle is the king of the sidewalk. Anywhere you can walk, you can pretty well get there on a tricycle. And uh, you have to hold bicycles up, but tricycles hold you up. And uh, everybody knows that uh, tricycles is 50% better than bicycle. Four out of five of your mamas agree. Okay, I'm gonna go for a ride. All right, we're gonna take the first ride here. Okay. Okay. First rule of tricycling is do not put your feet down. <laughs> yeah, proper air pressure makes a lot of difference in the riding stability. Bear that, I have to bear that in mind. Now this is a ride. 
I can make these for people, but I'd have to charge an awful lot. At least 6,000 is what I figure is the best deal I could give them. There's a lot of work involved and it's crazy. And chances are it's like a like a beautiful glass bong. You know they're beautiful and they work good and everything but they're short for this world. Eventually they're going to tip over and fall and break. Pretty easy to imagine having a windshield on it, but it's pretty nice to enjoy it without it, I guess. Get a lot of air. Uh, cruising style now. See, 163 watts, 400 watts, 300 watts, 500 watts. This is a 2000 watt motor, so we're not even getting close to capacity. pedaling for what it's worth. I don't know how much I could pedal this big beastie, especially in high range. <laughs> but at least I can still contribute. It'll be interesting to see what the range on the new prototype is. Should be able to go all day long. 30 miles into the night. Burning the lights. That's our hope. We'll see. It's nice to be under the shade of the solar panel. This is a hot day. It's 100 plus degree day today. Perfect day. Perfect day for solo. Solo like sunny days. But well, I'm just hoping nothing burns up. I just hooked up the solar panels. And it's hopefully everything's going to be all right. It's supposed to be automatic, all that, that, that charger. Automatically detects the voltages, automatically 
adjust everything and smart, smart, smart. Oh yeah. Let's see if you can see out here. Just still got some wires hanging around out of the front there. Boy, it sure rides nice and quiet though, don't it? We're cruising 20 kilometers an hour. An hour about, I guess about 10 miles an hour, I don't know. Whatever that runs. Having this thumb, thumb throttle instead of a twist throttle is kind of a trip. Let's go ahead and run it up a little bit. There's a thousand watts. It was 600 now. I just. Better watch out, wind's going to be a problem if we get any big gust of wind out here on the prairie. It happens. I can't believe that two weeks ago I was just talking about this and now I'm actually doing it. It's actually running. We're going down the road on our first test drive, real test drive. Into the wind, uphill. I can't change that. I guess I'll have to get used to kilometers and everything else. If I have to, I have to. At least it's working. Everything's working. Or so far, it seems like it's working. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. I got a horn that'll wake you up in the morning now. Big wind, nice big wind here. 1200 watts. That's a lot of power. Twelve hundred watts. Wow. This thing is a beast. No doubt about it. That's the way it's going to be. I got to make all the adjustments and figure everything out. Okay. Turn signals on. Cars are going around. Okay. Everybody's happy. Well, I can't believe it. First test drive, and we're going out on the damn boulevard. And 
maybe out on the highway it looks like that's a lot of faith mister a lot of faith Stupid, stupid, I got the damn turn signal going down the road. No matter if I got a big knob on me or not, I'm still stupid. No, you can't fix stupid. It's hot out here today. Well, I need to carry this thing home. If I had to, I would, though. Got to remember to get my strap out of it. The other one. That's the only way I made it home is I had a strap to pick up the front wheel and tow the solo home by foot. It was several miles. Getting on five miles. fenders on I can't see the tires I'm used to checking my tires to make sure they're not flat it's gonna make it a little tricky with them nice fenders on there place to test for crosswinds. Well, it's a bad place to test for them. <laughs> it's a good test is what it is. It's a bad place. So far, so good. Feels all right. Not too much different from the first solo. It's mighty top heavy too. Damn roads all jacked up over here. I remember now that's gonna be a drag. Okay, well, I didn't mess around. I went all the way out here to 
Pueblo West Walmart. Uh, my test drive. First maiden voyage. Okay, so we went uh, 15 kilometers. Alrighty. I guess we got go about 15 back. Got a phone holder. Got a drink holder. So look out. Okay, I'm gonna turn it around so you can see what's going on here. Okay. Yeah, I didn't mess around, I went right straight to the highway. <laughs>
I got stranded out here, I could just screw it to the back. Get drag.
Bridge. Right on the sun. Takes all the floor.
fresh fun. Which way, where'd you go? Oh, be he alive, or be he dead, I'll grind his bones to egg.
Just went on a pretty good little trip here. Uh, about 30 kilometers when I get home. So probably about 15 miles. It's still reading full. You might have done it. So our capacity seems to be great. So far so good. I should always be ready to go. Wow. It's too good to be true. Thank you, God. Thank you so much. There's no doubt that God helped me through all this. May all this happen. I'm not sure why. There is no doubt. Everything just fell together. Ordered the stuff, and it was all the right stuff, and it came right. Put it together in about two weeks, I think, basically. Every time I got a new piece put on, another new piece would come in the mail. this around now. Down with wheels. Park it in the sun, let it charge. Charge like crazy. It charges in the shade too. That was our first maiden voyage. The mirror, I have to do a glue job on it. Cheapo mirror. Anyway, it's just leaning that way because the, the spot there is unlevel. So anyway, it works exactly as built. There's the numbers on the charger. Yeah, we run it down a little bit. 54 is a full charge. It's down to 50. But that's still damn good. There's the old Solo. There's the new Solo. I've got to get my slow vehicle sign on it. And uh, that's about it. Put my mirror back on. Yes. Thank you, God. God help me through all this. Thank you, God, for my new soul.